Let's do the University of Austin launch video. Should yes, we do that tomorrow, we have to or do, do that. we need to do that right we now? We have okay. to do it now. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm sure you're aware of the University of Texas, Austin. At Austin. At Austin. Hook 'em horns, right? Right. Yeah. Kind of famous. Kind of famous. Well, you better well, not do start with this, this on this point. campus. Uh, Don't do this. Back in the day, uh, John <laughs> Benjamin and I and a couple other guys uh, in uh, Boston were uh, starting a comedy group after we were in uh, something called Cross Comedy. And that uh, broke up. And we, uh, we were going to start another one. And I was like, we, we, should just, we should take the name The Beatles. We'll, it'll draw some attention. <laughs> you know? Because, like, people say, The Beatles? What? It'll be confusing and this and that. Again, it's like the AP, Alex yeah. Perrine. Alex Perrine did yeah, the same maybe thing. Maybe people yeah. ac accidentally end up at your show thinking they're seeing the Beatles. Alex did it with a little bit of irony. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> not, these, however, not these folks. Barry Weiss, Brett Weinstein, Heather Hang, Steven Pinker, and others have a new um, uh, venture. And Larry Summers? Is Larry Summers involved in this? Yep. Bogosian. Larry Summers. Wow. wow. This is sort of like the um, Harvard of Corinthian colleges, as we call it. <laughs> Trump is... University, but more respectable. Exactly. Trump University blazed the trail. And we just filled the void. Uh, they're trying to get their nonprofit uh, uh, status. I would imagine. Will they be taking money before they get that status? Probably. <laughs> okay, yeah. But my guess would no, be they're yes. not in it for but, that. But let's be clear. Um, if we were to set up a nonprofit right now, and we took money in, we could all draw salaries. Majority you? Majority universe. <laughs> okay, but here is uh, here is their launch video. <laughs> Alec Cowan. So wait, now, was those all the students that are going? Or is that, uh, wake who are those people? Oh, they're the professors. Are they the professors? They are the thinkers that are going to, that they're going to, wait, did I see Larry Summers in there? Or did I just no, see No, you did Twitter? see, you did see Larry okay. Summers on there. Yeah. He's going to. I want that. Yeah, the econ oh, department is a lunatic. The econ department with Larry Summers and Tyler Cowen is going to be fantastic. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Maybe Summers will like expand his reach and and he'll wade into sciences and then he'll tell all his female students why they're like uh, they don't have the right aptitude, the intrinsic aptitude. Isn't that what he said about women in science? That's why they can't understand it. Let, let's be clear here, folks. I mean, uh, first of all, I, I I don't know if they're going to be teaching these like uh, MOOCs, right? Those uh, what are like those what? massively online course. Yeah. But um, the thing to be to watch here, look, if people want to go to this non-accredited university, twelve thousand dollars is how much is that how much it is? That's what I saw. Maybe that was a, a joke. If they want to go to this non-accredited university, I say yes. Uh, yes. Go go with God, and hopefully, maybe they'll show up at the Holiday Inn where they they promise to do a live in in person type of thing or whatever it is. But the real, the real sort of fascinating thing is going to be see if they they pull the same for profit uh, scam, and they're trying to get their nonprofit status, but nevertheless, where they go for student loans, mm. that'll be very interesting. Mm. Federally backed student loans. Um, what percentage of their faculty do you think is buddies with Jeffrey Epstein? <laughs> We'll see. Yeah, Larry the, Summers for one. That's the joke um, uh, Hassan made. It looks like the Oh, really? Uh, Damn it. And also, Stolen valor. I, I, I just want to um, sort of verbally retweet Will Maneker's joke on Twitter, which is said he, he's going to be majoring in, in NFTs and minoring in ethnic cleansing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, my God. What their theater department's going to gonna do, like, uh, not Hamilton, but Robert E. Lee <laughs> instead. <laughs> Barry Weiss is going to teach a class on protesting pro-Palestinian professors. It's funny. That's even, the yeah. Even Glenn uh, Greenwald hit her for that. Hit them with that. Like, is it going to be? Are you going to be allowed to uh, talk about Palestine at this university? Right. Exactly. 
exactly. They're going to be producing maps that are like, you know... <laughs> I can't wait for the output of this university. I want to see what the syllabus looks like. I want to see the signed readings. I want some lecture footage. It's going to be great. It's going to be it's going to be pretty funny, actually. I mean, what is it's going to be regular content for us? They're going to have a regular science department, and then it's anti-vax 101, and yeah. and a skull size determining uh, determining intellect 101. Yeah, for knowledge, for racists. Well, that's kind of redundant. You're you're gonna have to. Uh, every thesis is gonna have to be written on the Balfour Declaration. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, they already did this with Liberty University. Like, if you want to be a weirdo, if you want to be Liberty a, University is the religious one, right? But I mean, that's like a, if you want to be a right winger that goes to college, just go there. Oh, Hillsdale. There's that, a lot of them. But that's actually, a secular one. But, but that's actually is, a real school. Like, this is just gonna be for again. Um, this is the tax purposes or, or whatever intellectual dark university oh yeah they are they are clear to make sure that if you do want to donate to this uh i think it's called the cicero project or something like that is the the, co the company you can donate to help uh support these students and the uh, faculty uh it's all tax deductible so go for it um this is it's like there's just a just a like an Ayn Rand uh, like a feel to this whole thing. But the funny thing is, is like usually you can only point to like yeah John Galt in fiction actually trying to make this work because if they actually do try to make it work, it's going to end up being ludicrous. Uh, so I applaud them for actually trying to follow through here. Let's be clear too what the premise is. Every <laughs> single university in the nation is um been corrupted in not teaching truth every single one that's why they had to create their own mm. because there wasn't another one yeah not the ones that they're still maintaining like pinker uh tenure at right Harvard. not the one that larry summers was the president of no there's not a single college not a single one that's why they had to build their own i mean i thought this was the hoover institution but whatever exactly i mean if you feel like everyone else out there is crazy and the thousands of institutions out there are the crazy ones, but you're the only not crazy one, maybe there's something wrong with you. <laughs> is Peter Thiel backing it? I wouldn't be surprised. That would be, that would make a lot of sense. tax deductible Cicero research donation.